All right, so a while back I did a video on these uh, uh, flat towing brackets from Rough Country. And so I've had a few people asking on how we are doing this um, actual tow bar. So this is a tow bar that we built ourselves. And um, if you're not wanting to go through the liability of actually doing something on your own, then I don't recommend this because this is, you know, a vehicle that you're going to be towing down the road. You don't want it to like break and come loose, but it's really no different than building a trailer and towing that down the road. Um, so you can see here how we did this. You know, everything is just overly built, overly engineered. Uh, this was just a three, uh, three quarter inch bolt that came through. Um, it had threads on it. We turned it down, drilled a hole so that these uh, safety pins can hold that in there. We've got a UHMW plastic that's on the inside of here. Uh, it's basically the same stuff as a cutting board. Um, since these are three quarter inch bolts and this was a seven, seven eighth inch hole, I uh, just found some nice little bushings from a small engine on Amazon that fit the hole, had the inner diameter we were looking for, and you know, everything's nice and tight, took up all that uh, slop that was in there. So again, four pin harness here, wrapped around, coming out right to a seven pin and uh, you know, just a nice, nice tongue. Got some uh, two by three box tubing, uh, eighth inch wall. And then we just got an inch and three quarter pipe here. Um, everything cut and welded together on, uh, you know, the angles we were looking for. The beauty of building one of these for yourself is this was built specifically for our, uh, you know, tow vehicle. And this one specifically is five feet in length and basically what we did was we just made sure that any interference whenever you're backing up you jackknife it um, the motor home is going to hit the frame of this tow bar before it gets into the bronco itself or before anything even hits uh, the motor home everything is just going to be uh, up out of the way easily you know repairable and uh, you know very durable so there you have it. Hopefully this gives you some ideas, uh, something you can look for. They do make some ready built uh, tow bars. This isn't a big heavy vehicle, so it's not too difficult uh, to find something out there. Um, but anything built like this that you can find, they're you know, upwards of $800 and uh, you know, a lot cheaper, a lot easier if you've got some basic welding skills and uh, a little bit of time. So this whole one here, like I said, uh, you know, they get very expensive. I think at most there's maybe $300 into this one. So get everything you want, build it yourself. And hopefully that gives you some ideas. Again, if you're not comfortable building this yourself, you know, maybe this will give you some ideas on, on what to look for. So, uh, if it helps, make sure you hit the like button and as always make sure you subscribe. All right, everybody, I'll catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching.